Welcome in to the Fantasy Football Game Show presented by Front Yard Fantasy. I am your new and improved host, JL, joined as always by Joshua Walter Foster. Hey, I'm here. Let's go. He's here he's here. We are also joined by a very special guest, Dynasty Outhouse, aka Russ, who's the podcast director at DLF. He's host of the Trade Addicts podcast as well as Dynasty Game Night. The man, he gets around the industry. Everybody knows him. He's well loved. We're so glad to have you here. Russ, how are you doing today? Oh, I'm great now. It always makes me blush still when people say nice things about me. So <laughs> Josh, I'm my, my face is matching my shirt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, you, look, you look great, Russ. Did you like that? I'm saying something nice about you. you know. <laughs> Josh is just I, I'm not let, I'm, You're not getting in here. You're not getting in <laughs> no, here. No, 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 uh, no. No, I'm, I'm a nice guy. You know, you don't want to beat me. <laughs> <laughs> Josh yes, tried to intimidate Russ like he does every single guest that comes on the show. Uh, before they play against each other, but it didn't work. Russ just turned the tables work. on him before the stream. Uh, honestly, and now I'm Josh pretty intimidated. Still... Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty intimidated now. <laughs> it should be. It should be. Craig in here saying, let's keep all the outhouse jokes in-house today. Okay, chat crew. Seriously, oh, I'm not joshing this time. Oh, God. It was a double. That was, it was so a bad. double. It, it was, was beautiful. Double. It was great, but it was it was horrible. A it for was... effort. A for yeah. effort. J-Wall, let's get it. What's up, J-Wall? Let's get it. Jordan saying, hey, Craig, how's your team? I'm guessing that's a subtle dig at the listener league. It's mm -hmm. the listener league team. Maria in here. She says, you know, for attendance purposes. Of course, we yeah. will be taking attendance as we do every show. Welcome so in, no Maria. Freedom. You are Hold present. My paper. Maria was here. Yes, yes. Check mark. That's what we should do. We should call attendance and, you know, people in the chat. That hey, would be dude. kind of funny. <laughs> we should do that. Jordan says, Simon, where's Simon? <laughs> that's a good question. He is sick. Uh, and so... I don't know. He he must have eaten maybe some bad beet weeds outside or something. He often that grazes means. near his house. Yeah. What's and he a goat? He's a goat. Yeah, he's for sure right. a goat. Very he's a goat. Yeah. Oh. yeah. He's not the goat. He's, he's just dead. a goat. It's it's a little different. Very, uh, different. Very but different. kind of similar. Maria with the hey Jordan. Scott Fish says, "Do you need a show crasher? You can you can crash this show, Scott. We only got two contestants. You're definitely All welcome right. to join." Your call. He every time we play Fantasy Fortune, he's like, "Why do I never get invited to Fantasy Fortune?" Invite? So maybe this is your opportunity. I don't know, Scott. If you got, a, you got. A All right, hours, send him. A, send him a link, Josh. As we All go right, through these. Right. All right, I'll send. I'll send you a link just in case you want to join. And Jay saying, "Russ, it's my boy. That's my boy." And then Anthony said, "Jay Wall pick. Let's put Josh and JL on the clock live. We'll we'll make a pick live." We will. You can see our, our oh, thought shoot. process. How we're, our we're team actually work. on the clock. Well, we know we kind of know who I don't we know. pick already. We do. We already discussed it. Drop the mic. FF says, what's up, boys? What up? Drop the mic. Sorry about Clemson Jail. Thank you very much. It was a tough weekend. I cried a lot, but I'm doing OK. Doing OK. Oh, my mom is present. Josh, make sure you mark her off on the attendance list. All right. All right. Mom is here. Perfect. Scott says Simon is sick shortly after jail visited and had access to his food. Hmm. Very sus. Very sus of me. <laughs> Good call, Scott. I am now the prime suspect in Simon's poisoning. And uh, Jordan says, Josh, if you don't pick right this moment, he's going to do something. I don't know what. It seems hostile, but I don't know. And then Jay said, JL, did a gorilla escape from the zoo and punch you in the eye? What's wrong with my eye? Oh, because I got a mark on my eye? Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Exactly. Good call, Jay. And then Jay Wall says collusion. Wait, 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 wait. Are you guys too young to get that Waterboy reference? Is that what just happened? Oh, I love Waterboy. I, I just wasn't paying attention. What just happened? 
Was that is that a Waterboy reference? What, where? Where? Yeah, he where? had a black eye from playing football, and he told his mom that, uh, oh, that the gorilla escaped from the zoo. Ah, okay. That yeah. I'm just bad at started putting up flyers yeah. about uh, the gorilla and everything. But mama said, mama said, Swamp right. in here. He's got a trade question for us. He says so. He got a trade proposal. He wants to know what we think. He gets Gaskin, Chase Smith, who is John New Smith, uh, Chase Claypool. Yeah. And he gives away Travis Kelsey. That's yep. just Travis Kelsey. Yep. Russ, so you're a no? No. 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 Kelsey's worth so much more than that. I'm trying to think about this real fast. The, there's no he need to think. That, that is a dude that won't have any worth after this year. A dude that you hope to have you're worth this right. year. And Claypool's good. I don't care about... Look, DLF, I love you. Kyle Pitts is in tight end one. I don't care. <laughs> Travis Kelsey is the tight end one. Right, yeah, Scott? Yeah. I agree right, with the words I did not hear, but I fully agree with Russ. <laughs> See? Well, Russ well, is Russ, the trade me, expert, let, let, though. Let, let me tell you here. I, I completely agree with you. Dynasty, redraft, doesn't matter the context. Do not trade Kelsey for this. I guess, your running backs are strong enough. I mean, for this year, in a dynasty context, Chase. yeah, I'm pretty freaking nervous with Robinson, Gus Edwards, and Mike Davis. But uh, again, Gaskin's not going to really help that because I, I have a feeling he'll get replaced sooner rather than later. Johnny Smith could be nothing. And Chase Claypool, I love him, but not anywhere close to Kelsey. So, Russ, you summed it up very well. I, I'm right there with you. Hmm. Scott, you have a, a quick opinion? <sighs> not quick enough. Here. Not nope, not quick <laughs> enough. Uh, I'd probably keep the positional advantage of Kelsey. Kelsey. All right. Good question, Swamp. Welcome to the show, Scott. Are you excited to finally get to play Fantasy Fortune? <laughs> Is that what's going on now? All right. That's what do we're it. doing. That's what let's we're do doing. All I mean, right. You showed get, up. You showed up. You showed up. That's that's half the battle. Simon <laughs> couldn't even do that. Oh, <laughs> uh, showing is half the battle. I like it. All right. Before passing off to Josh to tell us the rules, make sure you subscribe, like this video. Uh, follow us on on uh, twi on Twitter, not Twitter. You can follow us on Twitch too if you want. But super easy way to support the show. We're here every single weekday, 3 p.m. Eastern time, playing games, giving analysis, talking fantasy football. We're also here uh, on Fridays, 6 p.m. Eastern time on FanDuel's channels, uh, playing games, and now Sunday as well. Sunday at 7 p.m. every single NFL Sunday. We'll be there recapping the game, talking fantasy. It'll be a good time. So come hang out uh, and support the show. Joshua. Are you ready? All right. To, oh, yeah, oh, we're going to yeah, make I'm our ready. pick. Real, is real, fast, real fast. Let's, let's just do so this. this. Let's make this pick. Um, so look, look, we have two quarterbacks. One's Tom Brady. One's Justin Fields. Obviously, we're a little concerned about Justin Fields. Uh, we're in a super flex league, so we need two qu starting quarterbacks to go into the season. You really want three. So I, we already kind of talked before the stream here, and we did decide that we were going to take the best available quarterback around the turn. And we kind of already discussed this, and we were thinking Sam Darnold. We, we were thinking about going Sam Darnold here. This is a redraft league. Um, and I, I see a lot of upside with him. Uh, what, do, what, do, what do you think, Russ? Do you think uh, Sam Darnold's a solid pick here? Uh, I got to be honest. My order okay. of what is on the... Okay, so the top four guys are the guys I'd be considering right now. Mac Jones, too. Uh, man, I'd probably go Daniel Jones, Carson Wentz, Sam Darnold, Ryan Fitzpatrick. No interest in Ben Roethlisberger, huh? None. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I mean, if this is Ben Roethlisberger's last season, he looked pretty bad last year. I do see some improvement coming from him personally, but I, I completely understand just taking him off your board completely. So you think Daniel Jones, is that because of his like rushing upside? Well, he's we, we've seen his ceiling like last year. You you can't count the offensive line was atrocious and Saquon was gone. It's like trying to judge the Panthers offense the second Christian McCaffrey went away. No, that's not the Panthers offense anymore. What we saw last year wasn't the Giants offense. Not only do they get Saquon back, their line was actually playing pretty well towards the end of the year. And now they have Kenny Galladay and Kadarius Tony. You know, they've upgraded literally everything from last year. And <laughs> Daniel Jones two years ago showed a 40 point upside. Not that it's going to happen often, but it could happen once or twice, and that's all you really need. That That's winning you a week, getting 40 points from your QB2 or QB3 at this point. You, you've almost sold me, Russ, but uh, I, I know JL and I talked about this going in, and we were kind of between Wentz and Sam Darnold ourselves. So uh, unless unless you sold JL here at all, uh, it's probably me between them two. What, what do you think, JL? 
Yeah, I, I would probably still lean Wentz. Uh, we might be able to wait on Darnold. I realize we're giving our strategy away now to everyone in the league. He's probably yeah, but also we're taking watching. a quarterback here. So, That's true. Yeah. That's true. Uh, Scott, what do you think? Wentz or uh, you said Daniel Jones is the other one? Well, I like Sam Darnold too. So, so is this dynasty or redraft? Redraft. Oof. Oof. Wow. I actually probably, <laughs> oh, not quick enough. Man. Nope, nope, that's not <laughs> quick enough. I'll side with what Russ said again. Sorry, I had work stuff pop up. <laughs> I think I heard you guys talking about Daniel Jones rushing upside at some point, so you must have been talking about Daniel Jones. Uh, I love when I crash and don't pay attention to the screen. <laughs> it's, it's so that's good. Power it's move. It really is a power move. It really is. That is that is the way to do it. Um, no, in redraft, I think I like Wentz a little bit more, but uh, they're they're close enough. They're in they're in that tier of you. You're kind of grossed out, but you got to take one, and, and they'll do okay. <laughs> you want to go yeah. Wentz, Jail? Let's go Wentz. Let's do it. Let's do it. I like it. I like Ooh, it. Let's go. We made a big is our I pick. barely said anything, and you took – You Russ convinced probably us. Had a, you convinced Russ probably us, had a bunch of data points or something. No, no, no. <laughs> Russ, Russ made great points. He actually kind of changed my mind as Daniel Jones is a late-round quarterback, but at the same time – Jail and I discussed this going into this pick already. We were kind of on Wentz or Sam Darnold, and we're we're trying to collaborate. We're trying to make a split mm. a decision together. So, you know, if you're on the Wentz side, Russ also said Wentz was his second favorite option. So, mm -hmm. I, I think Wentz was a good pick. Compromise. What's that? Okay. What's that there? We're done with that now. Um, we're going no, to finish, finish the rest of the draft. Best. Who's next? Let's do it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's do it. Well, you got to come for one attention. of our mock drafts then, it sounds like, Russ. It sounds like we'd have yes. a really good time together. Sign they never up. invite me to the mock draft. I tried <laughs> to join their Discord so I could get into the mocks early, and it said, no, Scott, you are not allowed. Yeah, there's a no Scott Fish rule in the Discord. This is bull crap, Scott. You say we never let you on any show, all right? You know, well, you, you can come whenever you want, all right? We'll, we'll make it happen. <laughs> Dynasty think, game night has been dog just ducking me for years. I was say, DGN, we have the title of No Scott Fish is Allowed. <laughs> Maybe oh, you're just man. not allowed on game shows. That, that's just what it comes next, down to. Right? Usually next, I just keep doing this until I get bad. Yeah, <laughs> people are sick of you. All right, guys. So we're playing Fantasy Fortune today. I know most people know about Wheel of Fortune, right? Wheel of Fortune, the big wheel everyone spins Heard everyone gets it. really excited. Yeah. Well, no wheel. We're getting rid of the wheel, but we are playing Fantasy Fortune today. It's a twist on Wheel of Fortune. We got rid of the wheel, like I said. Instead of spinning a wheel, the contestants will be asked a simple football-related question. You'll be expected to answer the question quickly. If you get it right, you get to guess a letter for the puzzle. For every consonant you get, you'll be rewarded $500. For every, If you want to buy a vowel, let JL know, and it'll cost $100 each. If you guess anything wrong, we move on to the next contestant. If it's your turn and you think you can solve, Go ahead, let JL know, and you can guess at any time. Whoever collects the most money over the course of the game will win Wins. today. It will be me. It will be me, guys. It will be me. If you say I, it enough times, I have a problem with you it. saying it to answer a simple <laughs> NFL trivia question because they don't well, seem that simple when I watch. Oh, they're so well, simple. Well, when I say simple, I mean it's going to be like 50 50. It will be maybe true yeah. or false, maybe an over under, maybe this guy or this guy who yeah, had more no, yards last year. I know. So. <laughs> they're not always so simple, though. You're absolutely correct. Simple, Sometimes they're not like, always easy. I think yeah, I'm just exactly. going to answer right away, whatever my first instinct is, without thinking about it. I like that. That's a good strategy. <laughs> All right, Russ, as the guest, would you like to go first, second, or third? Oh, I, I'm going to go first and not give anyone a chance. I'm going to get one Boom. letter and then solve it right away. Um, solve right, it without right. the letters. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. That's Got my it, preference. Oh <laughs> All right. That's Scott, how you, you want to go you win. Do you want to go second or third? I will go. I will go second. Oh second. yeah, yeah. You screwed up there. I, oh, I don't know. I don't know what's better. <laughs> All right, Josh, and third. All right, let's get in there. You guys ready to play? I just like being sandwiched between Josh and Russ. Yeah, it's nice and warm. It's not the first time we've heard that, which is weird. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah we hear that all the time. Russ, uh, Scott's always reaching out to Russ and I, and we're like, okay, I mean, we can make this One side sometime. is nice and cuddly. The other <laughs> side is nice and sweaty. It's just a, it's a good... <laughs> I'm, <laughs> nice I'm the sweaty side, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Choose your so own So good job being cuddly, Russ. <laughs> yes. Fantasy football term. All right, so your first puzzle is a fantasy football term. Russ, hmm. are you ready for your first question? 
Sure. Who did? Before we start, can we confirm that the spelling is right on these this time? JL, JL did this. I did it's my darndest. Josh, so, I yeah, did yeah, my yeah. darndest. All, All right. right. Hey, hey. And that I was only checked. one time. That was the first time we played, uh -huh. and I do not want to live <laughs> my whole life, going through my whole life, just you know, not living. You the triple day, checks, right? Josh. You triple checks. You, you and Joe Bryant, man. You and yeah. Joe Bryant. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good so one little thing you spell position wrong once and yeah you spell position you wrong everything. once it was you were so emphatic about i triple checked it I triple checked I swear everything. it's Everything's not right. wrong you can't triple stack a double stamp all right <laughs> all right stamp. russ here is your first question who had more oh, receipt right. Get out of the uh, oh, chat yes. because that's exactly what I just are did. Very good at guessing. <laughs> I exactly had it open, it so is. I clicked it to yeah. my Twitter. I was just most reading through the it. chat, and I was like, "Oh wait, can't be you." <laughs> yeah. So if you have any questions, feel free to put them in the chat, and feel free to guess along in the chat. The contestants won't see, and we'll get to your questions in between the rounds. All right, Russ, who had more receiving yards last year? So who had more receiving yards in 2020? Tyler Lockett. Or Juju Smith Schuster. Juju. I'm sorry. Juju had I see yes. I'm doing my best yes. Josh impersonation. Yes. Juju had eight hundred and thirty one receiving yards while Tyler Lockett had a thousand and fifty four. I don't know when uh, that was those must have come in maybe was like it, the first four weeks. That, no, it was just that one Cardinals game. He had a thousand oh, yes. yards and six touchdowns yeah. in that yeah. one. <laughs> that was exactly like six hundred yards that game, you yeah? know? Yes. <laughs> All right, Scott, we're moving on to you. You ready for your question? Let's do it. All right, who had more receiving yards last year? Cooper Cup or Calvin Ridley? Calvin Ridley. You nailed it, Scott. Calvin Ridley had 1,374, while Cooper Cup had 969. <laughs> nice, Cooper. Russ is up there like, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew the last one, too. Luckily. All right, Scott, what letter luck. would you like to guess here? Let's go with the T. All right, good choice, T. Good choice. Good choice. Two T's. Hey, Vanna White up there. Put yeah. down the T's. Let's go. All right. So I'll add this to your mm. account here. And this is all real money. It's coming out of uh, Josh's Bitcoin. My Bitcoin wallet. Nice. So, nice. so wh whoever wins will get however much money they won in Bitcoin. Yes. To them. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Scott. You got the two T's. I don't T's. got it. You don't got it? You need another no. question? Yep. You can't buy a vowel. You can also. Oh buy yeah, let's let's buy. Let's buy an A. You are gonna buy that, okay? So, A. Ooh, a. two A's. All right, all right, all right. Vowels and do I'm, cost a hundred dollars. Bob, Bob, I think that worked. All right. Mm. All right, Scott. What are you thinking? Solve, or do you need another question? Oh, I need another question. <laughs> you can't here. solve this, man. You what, can't are you, solve what are you doing? <laughs> I'm so worried I didn't spell something right now. <laughs> <laughs> the anxiety. All right, Scott, yeah. here is your other question. Who had more fantasy points last year in PPR? Okay. Who had more fantasy points? Stephon Diggs or Devontae Adams? Stephon Diggs. I'm sorry, Devontae Ooh, Adams yeah. had more. He had 360.4. Yeah. Stephon Diggs had 328.6. What's dumb is I knew that it was... <laughs> I knew there was Devante after about three seconds of thinking about it, but this <laughs> just, uh, this answer and immediately answer. thing is gonna screw me over. I think. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'll, maybe I'll try the vibes, Scott. Maybe I'll try to just go, just go, not think. Let's go. I like it. I like it. Hit me, Jail. Simon says Scott, or I get sick one time and Scott replaced. <laughs> yeah. Look, if you gotta get replaced, it might as well be by Scott Fish. Just it might as well, might as well yeah. be. And to be honest, he was gonna replace you whether you were sick or not. So. It just Both gave us the names easy start with an S. They have an it's O in them. Real easy. You know, it, it lines up really Very well, low standards. Know? Very low exactly. standards for replacements. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Josh, are you ready yes. to play? I'm never been more ready. I'm assuming you need a question here. I, I need the question. I don't know what this is. Okay. Who had more receptions mm -hmm. last year? Who had okay. more receptions last year? Mm -hmm. Robbie Anderson or Tyreek Hill? Tyreek Hill. I'm sorry. It was Robbie Anderson. Wow. That one was a little wow, tricky. That was a good one. How cool. That would have been my guess too, Josh. Nice. Wow. Rob, uh, Robbie Anderson. Anderson had so many catches. He had so he had 95 to be exact. He had 95 uh, catches or receptions, Tyreek and Floyd, Tyreek yeah. had 87. So yeah. I, I tricked yeah. you a little bit there with your own math. Sorry about that, Josh. But I'm just Josh, getting payback right. because you've done it to me so many times. It's this. I would nice never. Be, I would never. It's nice to be on this about? side of the table. 
That's fair enough. That, that was a good question, though. That was a good question. Kelly in here says, I'm here. In case you were wondering where I was. We were. We were wondering. That was like Always the first, wondering. Minutes. Yeah, first 12 yeah, minutes of the stream. Now we know. Yeah. Scott specifically was wondering. I just wanted to make him panic while he was not paying attention. <laughs> I was wondering something. <laughs> I was wondering something. All right, Russ, we're coming back to you. Are you ready? Born it. Let's go. Mm, born All it. All right. Who had more fantasy points last season? Brandon Cooks. Who had more fantasy points last season? Brandon Cooks. Sorry, I kind of lost my place there. Or J.D. McKissick. Oh, we got a cross-positional question. J.D. McKissick. That's what I would guess. I'm sorry. Brandon Cooks Man. had more. 231.3. Why are you? I've known the answer to every other question <laughs> except for the two you've given me. I just need to point that out. That's so perfect. That's, that's, so perfect. that's my bad. That's my bad, probably. Reverse order. Reverse order. <laughs> All right. You're Scott, the one who back. chose the one hole. <laughs> Don't blame this you on did. me. You did. Don't blame this on you me. You got to pick the two hole. That's where I'll I guess is always I'll, right, just like the customer. That's true. And Scott is never Scott right. Scott is the only one with money so far. So there's something about that two hole. He is. All right, All Scott. Right, I'm turn. All right. I'm guessing you can't solve. Nope. All right. Who had more rushing yards last year? Who had more oh. rushing yards last year? Is it Jonathan Taylor or Nick Chubb? Nick Chubb. I'm sorry. It was Jonathan yes. Taylor. He had 1169. <laughs> Nick, Chubb, Nick Chubb missed like five games. During he had that is true. 1065. Yeah. Yeah. Am I yeah. doing something wrong? Am I? No, 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 no. These questions? No, no. They're good questions, man. They're good questions. They're good questions. We're just idiots. I think, idiot I think we've reached we're the getting, point we're where done. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend a few seconds thinking yeah. about yeah. it before yeah. guessing. Adjusting his own strategy. I love it. We're getting warmed up. We're getting warmed up. Uh, we're gonna. Here we go. The whole stream is gonna be this puzzle. All right, Josh, who had more rushing touchdowns last year? Who had more easy, rushing easy. touchdowns? Yeah. Todd Gurley uh -huh. or Taysom Hill? Uh, Todd Gurley. He had like eight or nine. You're right, Josh. Todd Gurley had nine. Uh, okay, and I, I, I just go. I just inadvertently Josh Matthew again. <laughs> Taysom had eight. So. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> you did it. You nailed it, buddy. I did buddy. not know Taysom had that many. Wow. Thank God. All right. What okay. letter would you like to, to guess an, here? Give me an S. S. Yeah. Ah, Let's three go. Let's S's. Go. Let's go. Ding, okay. ding, ding. Um, and this goes to Josh. Boom. 1,500. Um, All right, Josh. What's the move? You can buy a value. You can take another question. Um... <sighs> I'll buy a vowel. Uh, let me buy an I. Buy an an I. Ah, ah, no, no, no. What am I sorry. doing? The stinker. Okay. All, right, All right, Russ, right. we're coming back to you. Can you solve or do you need another question? Oh. If it makes you feel better, I cannot solve. <laughs> I can solve, I think. Oh, no. I, I'm so... It fits. It fits, it sits. All right, I guess I need a question because I, I don't got that first word. All right. All right, here is your question. Who had more passing yards last season? Who had more passing yards last season's 2020? Deshaun Watson or Matt Ryan? Matt Ryan. I'm sorry, Deshaun Watson led the league with 4,801. <laughs> I knew that. Yards. Son of a... Russ is getting well, the I got Russ is... questions for himself. Russ is hey, going to punch Scott me in the face the next time solved. we meet. All right, Scott. Now's the put your, time to put your money where your mouth is. Do you actually Can you solve it? Are you going to solve I think, it? I think so, but I kind of want a question to, to make sure. Yeah. yeah. But All watch right. me get the question wrong. Okay. Let's go Same with the question. question? Yeah. All right. Get him. Get him. Get Here's your him, question. Bill. Who had more fantasy points oh. last year? Justin Herbert or Derrick Henry? Oh. Justin Herbert. Justin Herbert is correct. <laughs> 332. Well, Derrick Henry had 337.1. So not far off. Not All right. far off. So what letter would you like to guess here, Scott? I'm going to go with a B and hope that the first letter of the first word is a B. Yep. Okay. All right. Two Bs. Uh, yep. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah. As soon as I got my question wrong, I figured yep. it out. Oops. Okay, so would that like should get us. Would you like to solve or I would breakouts and busts. Yeah. You no. are wrong. No, I'm just kidding. You got it right. <laughs> nice job, Scott. Got I got out of that first yeah. puzzle, right? I wasn't I, I I went a little risky going for a question there to to just I make know. sure. I, 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 I just wrong. Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't sure Where's on the first word question? it fit though. That's a tough question. That's a tough one. That was, Put, that putting was. the highest scoring running back we all knew was the highest scoring running back in Derrick Henry up against a quarterback, that wouldn't yeah. make me nervous answering. To be completely <laughs> honest with you. Oh, I like this. I like that. I like hosting this game, Josh. Yeah, yeah. All it's right. a lot of fun watching other people struggle. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Scott, you banked eighteen hundred dollars from that puzzle. Well done. Well done. I don't have a question Sorry. for this one because it's just a term. Simon was sad that he missed Russ on the show today. Win it for me, Russ. Uh, we're, we're both devish, devishly handsome. Devishly he's handsome. He's talking about me and not Look Scott. at that suit picture of him there, too. <laughs> Did he you. just put that up specifically a, for that quote? This, yeah. Uh, <laughs> we're both devishly he, he looks handsome. good. He does. I think, I think that's <laughs> a NBA, wedding NBA, picture. NBA Rig likes the color of the background, JL. Maybe we should use that going forward. It's called Stadium. And I think the only thing that is Stadium about it is the green floor. <laughs> I think that's well you it. got the lights you got the bright lights you know yeah uh yeah. and i will say jay about three uh two minutes before we solved it got it uh, I, uh break up some the chat is good yeah, chat, the chat is too is good, good. That's yeah usually, usually i would say when i watch like when i'm in the chat the chat gets it before the ho before the host almost every time and unless almost they guess it right time. away it was yeah, like one time, time recently. I think I got it right or right before the chat, but that's the only time that I can remember that I actually beat the chat to the, the puzzle. <laughs> I think it was the Mike Williams one that I took a shot on. All right. You guys ready for your next puzzle? Yes. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's get in there. All right. And so Scott got that one right. So we're going on to you, Josh, per our yes. new rule here. This yes. one is an NFL Getting out of player. the chat. Out of yes, the chat. Please get out of the chat. Out of the chat. This Let's one go. is an NFL player. This. Nice, nice and easy. You guys nice and easy. You ready for your question, Josh? Yes. Hit me. All right. Who had more passing yards last season? Who had more mm -hmm. passing yards last season? Tom Brady or Aaron Rodgers? Aaron Rodgers. You're wrong, Josh. No? It was Tom no, Brady. Not. He had 4,616. Aaron Rodgers had 4,292. Yeah, he had. He Four, led in, in touchdowns. How many did Tom Brady have? He had 4,616. That's a lot of passing yards. That's Man, a lot, we are, whole lot. We are sucking on the questions right now. Come on, how guys. Much, let's do how it. How much money do I get if I guess it right without? You get a thousand. You get a thousand dollars. All right, I'm just going to try. Go for okay. it. Okay. Justin Herbert. I don't know what to do when it's wrong, so I'll just go bonk. Bonk. Oh, man. <laughs> That's a good it guess, fits. though. Good guess. That fits. is a really good guess. Really good guess. Wow. So and now I, I don't guess... feel as dumb because I wouldn't have gotten another question wrong. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You took exactly. a shot. You took a shot. I like it. I'm, I, so I guess, Scott, the, or, I'm, I'm sorry, Josh, that just counts as a turn, right? Yes. Okay. Can I just so, guess again anyway? Because I think <laughs> <we're>... <laughs> You just keep going. Just keep guessing yeah. until you get it. <laughs> All right, Scott. Can you solve? Okay. Are you brave enough? Or do you need um, a question? I don't have it, so no. I, I don't know. <laughs> All right, here's Sorry. your question. Who here's your question? Who had more receiving touchdowns last year? Who had more receiving touchdowns last year? Adam Thielen or AJ Brown? Adam Thielen had 14. I have trouble believing AJ Brown beat that. So Adam Thielen. You are correct. Adam Thielen had exactly 14. AJ Brown had 11. You got it right. What letter would you like to guess? Uh, let's go with... God, this is not easy. <laughs> you just got to um, pick a letter, Scott. I know. Let's go with an R. Show me. Hey, you with R. Bong. Oh! Oh! oh. I'm glad it happened oh, because man. my next guess would have been wrong. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right josh you can you solve oh there? no i think i got it <laughs> it's yeah, i've it. three names so far and they're all wrong <laughs> oh no no i don't one letter <laughs> off 
I love that. Unless you misspelled it. <laughs> um, oh Scott's always blame the misspell. Always <laughs> blame the misspell. Tim says, George Skittle. That makes <laughs> sense. I like nice. it. I like it. They said, Huston Gerbert. I like that one yes. as well. And he said, Bonk. I love classic. jail. Spots. Signature Bonk. Yeah. All right, Josh. Hit me. You ready okay. for a question? I, I'm ready to tear this game up. What is going on? <sighs> All right, who had more fantasy points last season in PPR? Uh, who had more fantasy points last season, 2020, in PPR? Was it Darren Waller or Tyreek Hill? I hate these cross-positional ones, but it's got to be... Oh, it doesn't have to be at all, but I'm going to go with Tyreek Hill. You are right, Josh. It is Tyreek Hill, 328.9. Darren Waller had 282.5. wasn't super <laughs> close. Sad. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, what Lee, letter give me an S. Like an S? S in Sam. Yep. S as in uh, mm. centipede? Salty. No. Two no, S's. Not... <laughs> hey, give me that money. Two give me money. S's. Oh, yeah, money. All right. Two S's. Josh, what would you like to do here? I'll buy an A. Buying an A. One A. I was nervous. That made me nervous. G give me another question. Another question. All right. Mm -hmm. Wow. All right, Joshua. Is the here's your question: Is the Arizona Cardinals is their oh, win my. total line set over or under nine? Hmm. I know this. It's not helpful. I'll go with the over. I'm sorry. It is just oh, under at eight point wow. five. Don't We're moving that's on. So over, Gail. <laughs> We're moving on. We're moving on, you dingus. All right, Russ, you ready for a question? Sure. All right. <laughs> Unless I... No, yeah, go ahead. So is the Carolina Panthers, is their win total line set over or under nine total wins? Under. You are correct. Set at seven and a half wins. What? What? What yeah, letter would you like a, to do? A game and a half difference and me a half a game difference? Yeah, you do what I want. For me. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm king of the ship. Fair All right, fair Russ, fair. what letter would you like to guess here? N. N. Two N's. Add that oh, to your yep. down here. That banks you $1,000. Would you like to solve or buy Val or take a question, Russ? Oh, I'll solve it. Yeah. Okay. Jameis Winston. Oh, <laughs> There it is. You got there it. You go. There it is. There it is. Oh. I, I got one puzzle. This is a victory for me. Wow. <laughs> That's I more than it. I could say, Russ. That's more than I could say. <laughs> yeah. See so you add your money. I there. did not have that at all. <laughs> oh. Did you have did. that, Josh? I did. I he okay. Did. He, I would just I need to point out how baller I would have felt if it was Justin Herbert, by the way. Yeah, that would have been, been wild. <laughs> I, I will that say that Simon I've done, a couple times has just gotten it with no letters. I've I've done that in the chat, but never on the show with have the no you, letters. Have you done it, Jail? Uh, I might have I done Simon it once, has. but definitely not as frequently. Yeah. Uh, Dan Dan got it. Uh, let's see what that was <sighs> two minutes oh. ago, and then Jay Wall and Jay. Nico Hardman fits also the amount of letters. <laughs> oh, that's the, <laughs> even, the worst. Even when, when the N's came on the board, I still didn't have it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jay man. with a good one, Dan. So let me ask you, Russ, how are you feeling about Jameis Winston going into the season? Are you uh, where are you drafting him, or what are what are your expectations for him this season? You know, this year. Uh, Jameis is Jameis, man. It doesn't matter what team he's on. It doesn't matter who yeah. he's throwing to. Thirty and thirty, probably. He's he's gonna get his points. Yeah. Who's the, who are who's the pass catcher that you're most uh, excited about? Is the market Marquez Callaway? Kamara. Yeah, no, there's there is no <laughs> other right answer. There is no one I'm excited about. <laughs> Can we put like Jimmy Graham back there, even though he's like a ghost <laughs> at this point? I'd still feel better about that than anyone. He would else. do really well though. I mean, Jimmy Graham uh, with the Saints right now, I would expect to have I, ten receivers. That's the thing. Wild. Like I, I'm I'm a little more interested in Juwan just because just because it's Winston and how much he relied on Bray. Loves those giant end zone targets, but. Uh, yeah, it's it's mostly just Kamara. Yeah, I, f I feel like Jameis is gonna gonna get decent numbers though through spreading it around through whatever you know. 
yeah, yeah. throwing those. Hellaway week in. one though. I like I like that matchup week one. So. Yeah, yeah. Josh, what do you think? Do you think any love for for Adam Troutman or any other pass catchers on that team? Uh, no, not a lot of love. It's just like if we're talking about a fantasy context, I am not really spending any more than one of my last picks on one of the Saints pass catchers at this point. Other than Michael Thomas, I'll take in the late to mid rounds. Um, just you know with the possibility of him coming back, but it's it's still going to be later in the double digits rounds. And then Alvin Kamara, obviously. But outside of them, I'm, I'm not really getting super excited outside really late picks. Yeah, yeah, it's fair. Uh, Dan said Callaway went for 100 in Fab in some SFB divisions. I feel like I might have... I saw some some chatter in our uh, group, our, our league group or division group chat with... Uh, I think James Rodet might have shelled out a lot of cash for, for Marquez Callaway. You want to hear something sad? I completely forgot to put in bids. <laughs> <laughs> Your own party. I'm I'm uh, I'm gonna be so screwed in that league. I lost. Scott, ETN, I'm, I'm glad you're not the only one. <laughs> ETN and Irv Smith, I lost. Oh, that hurts. <laughs> and I had already gone with like a super high upside, super risky build. So I'm just yeah. I put mine in and didn't win any of them. If it makes you feel any better. <laughs> oh, I, I feel like it, the guys it that does, we're saying yeah, people paid all. up for, you know what I'm saying? Like people paid up for the guys worth having or picking up off of waivers. Yeah, absolutely. Rendon in here, he's got a question for us. He's his 10 team PPR super flex. He just completed his draft. Here's his team CMC, Josh Allen, Kyler. Wow. De- uh, DeAndre Swift, Robert Woods, Deontay Johnson, George Kittle, Brandon Cooks. Uh, as well as some, I, wow. I don't even know how, how this team's possible. How did you get the first three in? <laughs> yeah. I don't, I don't how, know. How did you get the first three, the first like five of the know. first or three of the first five picks? <laughs> and so his question, is there any trades that I should be making after week one to really have a solid team to really, to, <laughs> you're, I think you're there, I think, yeah, I think yeah, you're at the finish line. <laughs> I think you're fine. I think your team's pretty solid. Uh, let me think of something. Uh, yeah, I don't, dude, I'm package like two or running backs. Oh, I mean, okay. wide receivers. Yeah, like put like Damian Harris and something together, or and uh, like Michael Carter, throw them together to go get a better wide receiver. Because yeah, if you want to call uh, anything on that team a weakness, I guess it's he's got Judy Jamar Chase too. I, there's I, right, like this is he's got good wide receivers. Wait, wait, no. wait, we're. Were you the only person who actually drafted? <laughs> it was all. I feel like even an auto draft wouldn't have let that happen. Rendon, don't worry about it right now. Just enjoy week one when you outscore everyone by double and then maybe reevaluate. <laughs> yeah. The, the only thing I will say is if I have a team that this, that's this good, uh, my, my main strategy is going to be exactly what Russ said, is I'm just going to try and make incremental package improvements. So like package together two yeah. guys for like one level up. Especially uh, in a ten teamer, yeah. yeah. Yeah, especially if you're if you have uh if there's less, you know, you have a less than twelve team league. Um, but really it, because your team is so good, you're not like there's not really any sort of positional need. So that that would be my strategy. Marty says, What's up, fellas? Happy fantasy football eve. What's Happy up, Marty? Good to see you. Eve, I'm so excited. Let's yes. go. Troy in here with the eyes. Just eyes, no words, just eyes. And then he said, he, does, he doesn't man. need words. He doesn't that, need no, words. no, that was Troy seeing Jameis Winston there. He's like, remember guys, he got the LASIK. So, oh yeah. The, <laughs> he's just reminding us. Reverse la- what was that? Was that the quiplash episode? Josh is reverse la- LASIK. <laughs> I don't, I don't remember. Jameis Winston honestly. got reverse LASIK. And then Wahaj in here says, is that the fish man? Fantasy That's Aquaman. Fish man. That is, it is. Fantasy Fisher. Aquaman. Fantasy. Ooh. I like that. That's kind of accurate. You gotta JL, it, are you specifically killing time because we burned through so many of your questions? Yes, that was all <laughs> of my questions. You guys ready for your next puzzle? Speaking of, let's do it. All right. Oh, Ooh. my God. Biggin. Biggin. Is a here's biggin. a chance to catch up, guys. Let's go. Yeah, here's your, here's your opportunity. I'd like to uh, solve the puzzle. R- no. Russ, no. <laughs> Russ, you got that one right. So, Scott, you are up. And get Can out you of the solve? chat. Oh, yes. Yeah, Remind to get out of the chat. Let's, let's do it up. You want a question? Oh, yeah. I want a question. <laughs> I'm sure? not going to guess sure? that. No. Uh-uh. All right, Scott. Who had more fantasy points last year? Who had more fantasy points last year? DJ Moore. Okay. Oh, and this is PPR, by the way. Okay. All these questions will be PPR for future okay. reference. DJ Moore or Allen Robinson? 
Allen Robinson. You were correct. It was Allen Robinson. Uh, 262.9 points versus I lost him. Some other points that is less than that. <laughs> Josh, what, <laughs> Scott, what letter would you like to guess? I, uh, I feel like I feel like this is a quick brown fox type of thing. The lower I can't lose, <laughs> <laughs> so watch, watch me miss the battleship here. Z. Um, I'm doing a whole lot of '80s references and '90s <laughs> references on this show. Uh, let's let's stick with uh, a T. Nah, bad 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 T. Ooh, look at all those T's. Bonk 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 bonk. At this here. That's and Scott, wow, helpful. big money. All right, Scott, can big you solve? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, coward, coward. Oh, no. All right, you ready for your next question then? Sure. All right, well, Tyler Lockett in PPR okay. last season, he scored 265.4 fantasy points. Okay. Has he ever scored more than that in his career? Yes or no? Let's see. His first year, he, he had 10 touchdowns last year. His Two years ago, he also had 10 touchdowns. But did he have more yards? Time's up. Why What's it going to be? I'm, I'm going yes. I, I was wondering the same thing. Yes, that he has had uh, yes. more. Yes. Okay. I'm going well, you're 2019 wrong. was his top year. Dang it. You're wrong. Uh, 2019, he was close, 235.2. And the year before, he wasn't far off either, 222 fantasy <sighs> points. But this past year was his best year fantasy-wise. Which is so career. weird because he was terrible for most of the year. He was. He, I he mean, was... Tyreek Hill had over 70 yards only four times. He scored eight of his 10 touchdowns last year in three games. I mean, it's, that 28 touchdowns in the last three years, if that, if that drops off, I mean, he's going to kill teams. Yeah, all right, Josh, you ready for your question? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, I'm well, ready. Hit me. in PPR, last season, Amari Cooper scored 236.8 fantasy points. Mm -hmm. Has he ever scored more than that in his career? Yes or no? Yes. That's correct, Josh. He has. Uh, he has last season, this, the year before, sorry, in 2019, he scored 246.5. So you got it. You nailed it. But that was, this Let's past go. season was the second best in his career. Josh, what letter would you like to guess? I'll take the S. S, two S's. <laughs> Only two. I was expecting one or two more. Um, well, you... I'll buy an I. Buying an I. All right. Oh, why didn't I buy vowels? What is wrong with me? Two I's. Hmm. And... I'll, buy an, I'll buy an A. Buy an A. All right. So Ooh. Josh would waste his money. That's why. Yeah, mm -hmm, that's exactly mm -hmm. why. And that was four, I think. Yeah, four A's. One, two, three, four. Mm. All right, Josh. Give me another question. Another question. All right, Josh. Here is your question. It's mm -hmm. coming. Are you ready? Oh, I'm. So I'm definitely ready. not coming up with it right now. I'm. It's. I know. No, no, no. I'm ready, ready on for deck it. for you. Okay. Who had more rushing yards last season? Who had yes. more rushing yards last season? Aaron Jones, Aaron Jones, or Lamar Jackson? Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones is correct. He had 1,104 rushing yards. Lamar Jackson had uh, 1,005. Did I read yes. that right? Yes, 1,005. I, he did. I, I know he had just a tad over 1,000, Lamar Jackson. So, And I he knew did. Aaron Jones was over 1,000. So, Well done, Josh. What letter would you like to guess? Uh, let's go with an N. N? No, an R. An R. <laughs> an R. A -N. One single oh my. R. Oh, no. Wow. Okay. Uh, okay. What, what's it going to be, Josh? Question. Give me another, another question. question. Yeah. All right. Oops. I'm on the wrong computer really here. confused here, actually. All right, Josh, was the is the the Buffalo Bills? Yes. Is their win total line over or under nine total wins? It's got to be over. Final answer? Yes. It's over. It's at, yes. set at 11. What oh, wow. You really gave me some You must have felt bad about that last one. <laughs> <laughs> I gave you a little bit of breathing room. Whew. 
I was like, <laughs> okay, uh, let's go with uh, an H. H, as mm-hmm. in Harold. Or Harold. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus. Two yes. H's. Oh, my. Wait. Oh. Um, I, I confused myself there for a second. I kind of forgot what the puzzle was, and I was like, that shouldn't be there. <laughs> All right, Josh. All right, I'll buy an E. Buying an E. Oh my. Four E's. Four. <sighs> four. Okay. So All right, Josh. Who is this? Right, give me another question. Another question. All right, here you go. Who had... Who had more fantasy points last season? Who had more fantasy points last season? Was it Matt Ryan uh-huh. or Derek Carr? <sighs> Matt Ryan. Matt Ryan is correct. Just, oh, yes. Just nearly. My goodness. <sighs> All right, Josh, what letter would you like to guess? Uh, give me a, a D. Two D's. I don't know what the first thing is at all. Uh, uh, um, get, uh, wait, give me an O. Taking it, buying an O. Yeah. Three O's. What? Did I mark off as E's? Yeah, you did. I'm pretty sure there's four of them. Um, I, I need another question. I need another question. I, I, I'm so lost right now. All right, Josh. Here is another question. I just can't figure out the first two words. Yeah, this me is, too. Is this right? <laughs> All right, Josh. Here is your question. Who had yeah. more rushing yards last season? Who had more rushing yards? Melvin Gordon or Kenyon Drake? Melvin Gordon. Melvin Gordon is right with oh, 986. Yeah. You're shaking oh, your head scared no, the crap out of me. Get it Give wrong. Me an L. Get Give it me wrong. An Give me an L. My God. Two L's. How do you not know this yet, Josh? I'm stuck on this. Can't be real. Oh, my God. I got it. Yeah. I, 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 I don't I know. I threw my glasses, um, too. Another <laughs> question? That's how upset you I got. Think I need... and, I'm, and, oh, great. And Russ goes after. Uh, I need a question. All right, Josh, here is your other question. Here's your other question. Who had more uh, Who had more targets last year? Who had oh, more targets? Oh, I know it. It's too late. You're I, already, I know, I know, I know. I hope you I get know, this question right. Oh, seriously, you still have to answer the question? Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yes, for it. All right, Josh, who had more targets last season? Who had more targets? DK Metcalf mm-hmm. or Brandon Cooks? Brandon Cooks. I'm sorry, Josh. Yes! DK, DK Metcalf at 129. Well, it doesn't matter because Ross can get it now. But Brandon Jesus. Cooks at 119. Oh, no, what so the hell? Are you serious? Tevin Coleman listed as top back on depth chart? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you nailed it. I didn't no, think you were going to I know that's the answer. I, to to the, the, to, I know that's the... Really? I mean, <laughs> I like Tevin Coleman. Don't get me wrong, but that just doesn't seem like the right thing to do. <laughs> as a like for the Jets perspective, as a, yes, as a team, that just seems wrong. <laughs> oh, Tevin Coleman is such a weird name. Tevin Coleman, well, especially since we just had word. the vowels for so long and the T pretty much, it was just really there. tough to figure out. That's the yeah. only reason I got it. Oh, really? Oh, man, yeah. I had to figure I, out what I saw it was a name because I figured out something on depth chart. So I had I, the yeah. first two words had to be a name. I, ha- I had listed on for. Yeah. a decent amount of time there. I yeah. just yep. could not yeah. figure out the name. <laughs> I was oh having, I had God. trouble with top back as well for a little while in there. Yes. Um, but I got, yeah, yeah. I, I figured that out and I was like, who is, the, Oh, and I figured it out as you were saying the question, but did it get it? So Russ, you said this doesn't seem like a smart move. I'm guessing Tevin Coleman is not the running back. You want to roster on the jets for fantasy purposes. If not, is there any running back you're taking a shot on? Uh, in that backfield, or are you just hands off the Jets? Well, I think the right answer is Michael Carter, but I have so much LaMichael P. Ryan because he literally costs absolutely nothing. Yeah. And I, we don't know that Michael Carter is better than LaMichael P. Ryan, so worth a shot. What about you, Scott? 
yeah, it's, I mean, the, the long-term answer is Michael Carter. And I think, I think by the end of the season, I mean, if we're talking redraft, I think by the end of the season, he's going to take it over, but these first few weeks are going to be, are going to be interesting with uh, Tevin and, and Ty and whatnot getting, uh, getting just enough work to uh, with each other, you know, all of them getting just enough work to mess everybody's plans up for starting them in flexes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What do you think, Josh? I, I, Build it. I think it's a Dynasty sneaky play this week. There. Dynasty Griff's got it before all of us. Um, like a solid, uh, I, I told you because it wasn't my turn yet. Just saying. <laughs> um, you know, I got a lot of crap like three months ago for in our mock drafts, drafting Tevin Coleman, just so you guys know. You know I'll draft him at the very end. You and, deserved you know, it then, and you still deserve yeah. it now. Just saying. Yeah, so uh, I, I actually am still not <laughs> drafting him. Uh, I, it made me, it opened my eyes. Let's just say that. Um, I think Michael Carter has by far the most upside of all these guys. Um, Ty Johnson is my second favorite, then Tevin Coleman, then Michael P. Ryan. But again, they're all in the same tier, so pick your poison. Yeah. <laughs> Jay said, death chart. Is that what happened to Simon? Likely. Of all the oh, ways no. that <laughs> Likely. I do have to say that is the first word I thought of for that last word. Me too. <laughs> as soon as the H came in, that was when I forgot what the puzzle was. And I was like, well, that can't be right. Like my mind went to shark for some reason. I don't know why I said for some reason. It's because I hang around all day with Simon and Josh. That's exactly why. Uh, so just got a question here just so love bell for two force it's alarming how quickly it got accepted uh fourth round picks in a dynasty league really aren't worth much but at the same time but, love bell i don't but think they're still much. worth more than love bell somehow <laughs> yes <laughs> yes so if this person maybe has gus edwards and they're concerned about a gus edwards injury uh, i i could see someone making that deal for two force because it's too poor i would sell two force for just about anything at this point just for a why the hell not yes exactly exactly and then one other question, Rendon, uh, last question. Pick one running back, one flex to start this week. Swift, Damian Harris, Brandon Cooks, Jerry Judy. Um, one running back is is Swift for mm-hmm. me, um, given he's healthy, which it looks like he is. And then the wide receiver I'm choosing, uh, Jerry Judy has so much more upside. I, I, I lean Jerry Judy, but Brandon Cooks is so much safer of an option. No, he's not. No, not with a quarterback that's barely played there, hasn't played in God knows how long. And I'm, I'm with Swift and Judy also. All right. Scott, you the same page? Mm-hmm. Yep. Jail? Um, He's the host. Yep. No one cares. I, I, I would go back to the last question, though. I'd, I'd much rather have the two-fourths than Love Bell. Like, he's <laughs> not even <laughs> off the pack. <laughs> they, they signed Trenton Canton. Trenton Cannon to the to the 53-man roster before Love Bell. <laughs> like... I don't know what the Love Bell signing was. Maybe they they're like, oh, we lost Justice Hill, a a, a, a pass catching running back that has exactly. has not played very well for two years. Where's yeah. another pass catching running back that hasn't played well for two years? Let's get him on roster. Or a pick replacement. <laughs> like, well, that's that's exactly what it is, though, Scott. The Ravens needed a pass catching running back, and that's that's why for Lovebell's what. There. They have had 50 targets go to running backs last year. They had I'm 51 targets go to running backs they, the year before. As they a Ravens fan, I have backs. seen they have been trying to get the running backs more involved in the offense. I think it's because they don't want Lamar Jackson taking all these in, running. In uh, the impression. offense, but not the passing game. Like, there's no there's no data that shows they're getting them involved in the passing game. Um, I mean, no, no, no. In the passing game. Uh, in practice. They, well, okay. it was J.K. Dobbins, though. It was I have J.K. Not Dobbins, been to and that's a, completely no, I, different, I that's a completely different thing, though. <laughs> J.K. Dobbins is a completely different animal than Le'Veon Bell. So right. I, I, I'm going to let you have this one. <laughs> I'll let you have this one. All right. You guys want to do one more puzzle before we I get do. out of here? You got to give Russ his points first. Yeah. yeah so, so, Josh, do I, how do I get it to where it just does You just click that. Oh, fancy. Look at that. Look at that. We're doing stuff. All oh, right. I'm losing last... now. Yes, yeah, you are. Losing. I and bought I that one vowel and it has cost me dearly. Yeah, you, you really goofed. All right. Here. So this is a new yeah, one. You guys, new all the letters for that one. So this is a new category. It's NFL players mashup, which means uh, there's two players involved here. And they share, they share a no first way. and or last name. Uh, so a, a good exa- an okay. example, an example, an example of this you know, I might be, <laughs> stop, an example of this might be Keelan Cole Beasley. Make okay. sense? I'm up, right? You're up, yeah. Scott. Jamar Chase <laughs> Young. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry, you're wrong. Damn oh, it. So good. Yes. I, I would have never thought to include a defensive guess. player. 
That is a really good guess. Damn it. I thought I had that. He's just, so he sure I had, had that the category too. explained to him. He was just like, I know what you're okay, talking about. Okay, since Scott either. did it, I'm, it's my turn, right? No, 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 it's Josh's fine. turn. It's mine. Yeah. Okay, no, all right, Josh. You're gonna take a bet. You're gonna take a guess here. Do it. I don't know who the. I don't know who this could be. I know it. <laughs> well, hopefully, I'll let you. Get oh up. my gosh! I need this. I need this. I need this, guys. I How need, in the guys, world I could you guys know this? All I right, think Josh, I got it. Oh, these guys are freaking. Give, give me a question. There's, there's, all right, Josh. Here's yep. your question. I think Who I had more it, yeah. passing touchdowns last year? Who had more passing touchdowns last year? Was it Derek Carr or Justin Herbert? Uh, I think Derek Carr was low in the passing touchdowns category. I might go with Herbert. Herbert is correct. Uh, he had four more touchdowns than Derek Carr, mm -hmm. but not yeah. not not crazy. Uh, not too far off. All right, Josh, what letter would I'll you like to guess? An, an S. One S. Oh, uh. I... <laughs> that, that goes in line with what he was thinking i don't know who this is i just don't uh, know why you went with that second person if it's what i'm thinking <laughs> okay uh, all right I need another question. give me another question all right josh here is your other question who had more receiving yards last year who had more receiving yards last year terry mclaurin or mike evans Ooh, uh, 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 oh man, Terry McLaurin. Terry McLaurin is correct. Oh he had 1114 God. while Mike Evans had 1006. Oh my. Another I shot. Knew they were both Josh. Over it. Um, give yeah. me, give me, give me, give me the R. R. Ooh. I was wrong. Three R. I was wrong too. Josh by the way, just Keenan trying to Allen not get a zero. Hearns, by the way, fit perfectly. Oh. Which is uh, why I thought, like, why would you go with Keenan Allen Robinson? But, you know, oh well. <laughs> All right, Josh. Mm, or Josh uh, Allen Robinson. I'll, 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 which wouldn't I, fit, but I'm just saying. At all. No. <laughs> there's there's some good question. ones. Give me our question. Another question. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, Josh, who played in more games last season? Who played in more games last season? Calvin know. Ridley or Clyde Edwards Alaire. Calvin Ridley. Calvin Ridley's correct. Played in all 16. That was yeah. too easy. Yeah. What letter? I, I wasn't sure he played in all 16, but uh I, let's go with uh oh no. Uh a T. One T. Oh. <laughs> uh I wait. Oh wait. I just need to get the last one. What's it gonna be? I know it. I want to solve. I know it. Let's go. Yep. Hunter I got Henry it Ruggs. Yep. Yep. Josh. Did anyone in the chat get it? Yes. Yep. Oh. Yep. yep. <laughs> you yep. said that's all. Josh. I, I literally stinker. just went to check. Who? Did Tim? Tim got it. Tim, Tim did it? get it. Yeah. Good job, Tim. I, I, I well wanted to beat done. the chat so bad. <laughs> Somehow you won going from zero to 2500. I, I don't understand that at all. Look, all I said was we shouldn't play that last game. I don't did. know how Jamar Chase Young was not the answer. You know what's funny is I or had Allen, I had right? Jamar Chase Edmonds as one of the puzzles. So that's... when you said that, I was like, no way. And then I was like, wait, that's not the one I picked. Sorry, well, Scott. You that the next time you're hosting, Jay. Now, oh, now, now I'm not gonna. <laughs> or maybe I will. Who knows? Maybe you will. Yeah, really, really uh, confuse us. That All was fun. right, that was fun, guys. That was oh, Russ. I'm glad I won. Thank you so much for joining us. That was a ton of fun. I really, I really do like hosting this game. I'm gonna do it from now on. But this was, this was a blast. And thank you, Scott, for uh, for crashing yeah. and filling in for Simon here. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that game. I'm gonna crash every Good single one of them. So <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <sighs> let's see oh we got yeah so tim got it uh and anthony said josh you need some more money oh he got no, it i did i didn't need more money i had just enough money just enough money should have bought some vowels just should have bought some vowels <laughs> that's the only reason i didn't i was thinking about one vowels. more like, game right now i can't <laughs> one more puzzle Where's that coming from I feel like I hear a one more puzzle chat somewhere out there. <laughs> one oh, more about. puzzle. I'll, I'll leave it up to Russ. I have one. I have one at least more one more. Puzzle. But we're just about at time here. Russ, oh, do you want yeah, to another one or you want to call it? I mean, do you do I want to? Yes. If it's your time, it's your time. That's fine. I I will take my loss 
gracefully until you hit that stop recording button, in which case I will start flipping stuff. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys want to do it, I'll know. Okay you know what? I don't want Josh. Gonna, I, I just feel like Josh win, shouldn't win. Regardless. So I'm, I'm, let, let's do <laughs> one more. Extended hours, guys. Give Extended the people hours. what they want. <laughs> people ask give. for it. We're going to okay, give it to them. And this then. is definitely not the Jamar Chase Edmonds one. Don't definitely don't <laughs> guess that. Well, I promise. The category first, huh? I promise. <laughs> All right, here we go. New puzzle. If I can figure it out. Where's my speed mouse? round? It's already past three. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's let's hit it. Let's hit it. Fast. All right, Back NFL teammates. NFL okay. teammates. Josh, you got that one right. So Russ, it's up to you. You ready for a question? Oh, out of the chat. Oh, I, I, I go into it just so I don't forget to get out of it. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? I should probably try and answer at least one question correctly this show because I, I haven't done that yet. So I'll I know. Take a question. It, yeah. Oh man. All right. Here's what your does question. Scott think he knows it. I... Mm? Go ahead, go ahead, go All right. Ahead, here's your ahead. question. Who had more receiving touchdowns last year? Who had more receiving touchdowns last year? Mike Evans or Calvin Ridley? That's a good one. Calvin Ridley. I'm sorry, Russ. It was Mike Evans. He oh, had man, 13. I it was Ridley too. Wow. Ridley had nine. I thought that was season. a really good question, but I know Mike Evans' fantasy like success came from the touchdowns, so I might have gone that way. I'm mm. not, that was tough. I just I I refused to pick against Calvin Ridley, so it just it wasn't. That, That's fair. There's nothing That's I could. Of course, I'll, of I'll keep that. Don't in we mind all? Don't we all? Scott, are you ready for your question? Yeah, bring mm -hmm. it. All right. Who had more fantasy points last season, Nelson Aguilar or Jimmy Graham? Oh, oh gosh, darn Nelson it. Aguilar. Nelson Aguilar yeah. is correct. He had 185.6. Jimmy Graham had 143.6. What letter would you like to guess? <sighs> I'm winning this, boy. I'm going to go with an N. I, uh, this is just like last time, I got I figured out the answer right after I... Uh... You figured out the answer? Oh, no. no. Never mind. Um, <laughs> Travis Kelsey and Tyreek Hill fit. Uh, oh, yeah. That would have been really good. <laughs> All right, Scott, you have three ends. I'm going to give you a little bit of moolah here. Boom. 1,500. Would you like to solve? Another question? Buy a vowel? Do a dance? I, I will buy a vowel. <laughs> All right, what vowel? An O. An O. Scott's buying an O. Three O's. Oh, no. Oh, no. Two, three. Oh, no. One, two. Oh, no. Three. Don't All right, Scott. Yeah. Um, I'll solve the puzzle. No! He's going to no! solve it. Stefan Diggs no! and Dawson Knox. No! No! No, no, no! You nailed it. No! Stefan Diggs I and Dawson Knox. That was like a two minute puzzle. <laughs> wow. <sighs> I hate this game. Completely. Did I beat the chat on that one? Yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> So you got a couple of good guesses in here. Hunter Henry and Kareem Hunt. Damn, with Travis Kelsey and Tyreek Hill. Wow. At least I wasn't alone on that one. <laughs> yeah, you Just yeah, you guess the same one as you. That was, yeah, that's really good. Travis Kelsey and Tyreek Hill fits real nice. Yeah. And then Jay Whatever. says, as long as Josh doesn't win, it's a good day. Very right. true. My, I trash talked to Josh before we started, and technically oh, Josh lost. didn't win. So <laughs> that's true. You both lost. <laughs> You both lost. Whatever. Whatever. When I said Give he was going to gonna lose, I wasn't wrong. You were correct. It Scott. Give it to You're Scott. Correct. Well done, Scott. Your first debut on Fantasy Fortune. You won it. Well done, nice. sir. Russ, well, we uh, definitely have to have you back on play some more. It games. only took extra idiots and, 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 and me, yeah, me conning uh, everybody into playing. Yeah, more yeah, until I, can, let's play another puzzle until I win. Yeah, pressuring us to just keep doing puzzles until you were ahead. I Good don't strategy. think I lied to you before the show either, Russ. I I just said, "Are you ready to lose?" I believe so. And I did say yes. Also yeah. To so he, he also, yeah, he said he, <laughs> yeah. So we're both on the same page. <laughs> Dynasty Griffin here. Scott Fish on fire. Honestly, Scott needed that after his uh, previous performances, you know, I, being paired with I needed, I, need, yeah. I needed, a, <laughs> I needed a win today. I needed graceful. a win today. And just so you know, the three of us talked about it before the show that we knew you were going to come on and we were going to give it. I to felt you. that. I That's felt exactly that. <laughs> That, that was the thing. This show is for you, Scott. Oh, thank you so much for, 
for joining us, Scott. Thanks so much for joining us. Russ, make sure you're going and following Russ at Dynasty Outhouse. He's a podcast director at DLF, host of Trade Addicts Podcast and Dynasty Game Night. Both are fantastic, by the way. Trade Addicts with uh, uh, Rusty, right? Rocky. Rocky, my goodness. why I was like, blanking there for a second. Rocky, uh, yeah, dude. Trade Addicts Podcast with Rocky is fantastic. I love Rocky, that. And, and if you go back and look, Dynasty Game Night, you'll find Front Yard Fantasy Boys on there. Oh, we boy. Played. It wasn't wasn't particularly uh, a great performance, but we played. We played all right. But you no, seriously, you guys handled the show very well. I, I listened like I had to edit like nothing because you guys know just keep talking, man. Just that's all that matters. Keep, <laughs> don't make me edit. Just keep talking. <laughs> that's exactly that's that's why we live stream is because we hate editing. <laughs> that's really the whole thing. <laughs> the whole thing. All right. Well, that is gonna wrap it up for us today. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, subscribe to us on YouTube, Front Yard Fantasy. We're here every single weekday, 3 p.m. Eastern time, playing these games, talking fantasy football, uh, and and Fridays at 6 p.m. Eastern time, FanDuel's channel, super fun. We got Nando DeFino from The Athletic uh, joining us this week. We're we playing Fantasy Fortune, so Scott might oh, have to crash. Oh. Scott might have to crash. <laughs> Nando's the current champ. Current champ. And oh, then, man. this starting this Sunday... Yes. Starting this Sunday at 7, we ba, 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 ba. will be doing a Sunday recap show. We'll be talking about the, the day's games. We'll talk about the highest scoring fantasy players, all that good stuff. It's going to be on Fandle's channels. We are going to have a great time, aren't we, Jay? Yeah, join us. Come hang out. Sounds all right, guys. Good. Hey, we'll treating makes fantasy fun. It does. It does. <laughs> all right. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Hey.